Okay, one of the most important casts in small streams like this is the bow and arrow cast, so we're gonna run through that right now. We see a lot of anglers holding the fly when they want to perform a bow and arrow cast, which is fine if you want a bow very short, just under the rod tip. Sometimes we find the fish might be at 20 feet, 25 feet. So the best way to bow and arrow a long cast is simply by extending the fly line and holding the required distance. So it could be right up towards your leader there or even holding the fly line itself, which gives, gives you more physical weight and allows a better presentation. We're using today on the river a beautiful Scott fly rod here, a soft action rod, a G series, perfect for these conditions. A short leader, important as well, around seven feet. Our stance when we're performing the bow, if you're a right hander, you want to turn your body side onto your target. So right shoulder towards target and stand with a slightly open stance with your legs here. When we're holding the leader or the fly line, we hold from the top there, not from the bottom, not the underside. And we increase the, intention, the tension on the fly line by pulling back. And if we feel like we need to increase the tension, it's simply by popping a little figure of eight with that left hand to increase the tension there. Increase the tension on that fly rod there by bending it. Now we want to keep this left hand high and we want to keep the rod flank horizontal or parallel with the water there. Pretty much forming a box, a rectangular box from where my hand is, my right hand here where the bend of the rod is. So try not to bring that uh, hand low when you lose tip control like that. And also it bows better. You won't break the rod if you actually hold up that fly line a bit high with that left hand, okay? And simply take your time, look down the barrel just like a shotgun there. Bring it close to your left eye. Hold it and just move your rod tip to the direction you want to bow and simply let go. When performing the bow, make sure you place the fly somewhere where it's not getting caught up, one of the most important things. So I'm just going to place this mud bank here, give that rod a good bend, keeping this left hand high again, send it over that far side there. And there we go. Oh, look at the bigger fish tasting now. 